Okay, here's how to take a regular Bluetooth dongle and modify it so that um, it has an external antenna socket. First of all, we need to open the dongle. That's the lid off. That's the base off. You see there we have the itself and you can see the antenna is actually part of the PCB and we're actually going to um, take away part of that and uh, reroute it through an external antenna socket. Okay. So first of all we have to grind away part of the um, PCB that forms the antenna so I'll do that now using this Dremel grinding tool let's turn it on So now you can see that part of that has been taken away. This part here I've left because we're going to use it as a, an anchor point for um, the outside of the MMCX antenna socket. Um, so it's going to act as a securing point, and then the center pin will be attached to this trace here. Um, which is near to the antenna output here on the board. Okay, so the next stage is to drill out three holes on the uh, Bluetooth dongle to take this. Um, MMCX uh, PCB mounted antenna socket. We're going to first break off two of these legs um, because there isn't room for all four of these outer legs. Um, so we're going to do that now. I'll, I'll break two off. Um, so we have the center one and two outers. I'm going to do that using a pair of pliers. You can see hopefully now that two have been removed. I can file the two that I've removed. If there's any residue, just use a nail file to file them flat. Okay, so you can see that. They are now flat, and I've got the center pin and two outer pins. I've made this simple tool out of a sheet of plastic. I originally pressed the antenna socket against it. You can see I can use this to mark out where the holes need to go on the uh, circuit board where we've just erased. Um, the traces using our Dremel sander tool. Okay, so now I'm going to take this hobbyist drill with a 80 millimeter drill bit. That's the um, code for RS supplies. If you want to get one from them, the website is rswww.com part number 2848272 so, let's turn on the drill, it's going to be a bit noisy
light. Hopefully now you can see that the centre pin is near to the trace. I've got two holes with the other outside pins which I can solder onto the outside points. I'll do that now. So you can see the centre trace is soldered in here and then we've got a nice big lump of solder holding the other two pins down against the uh, what was left of the antenna track. That isn't actually, this part over here at this end isn't actually connected to anything. If you turn this over, you can see the socket is now mounted in an ideal spot. We're going to put some solder bridging the, uh, the outside spot here to the earth. Point. 